108,000 cars off the road. And to make that special blend, Crimson uses a variety of oils and fats, like this used cooking oil and this brown grease. And through production, this will turn into this low carbon biodiesel. We collect used cooking oil from you know, Seattle all the way down to San Diego, and we have over 25,000 locations we collect from. Once the oil, fats, and grease is collected from business partners like fast food restaurants, universities, sports arenas, and grocery stores, about 16 trucks transport it here to the Bakersfield production plant every day. The used cooking oil comes in, and we refine it into biodiesel. And after the oil is refined, trucks like this will fill up and take it to local gas stations. Simpson says Crimson spent tens of millions of dollars building this new ultra advanced biodiesel plant with help from the state and others. And also adds biodiesel has economic health and environmental benefits. The fuels that we produce here, they result in a carbon reduction of anywhere from 80 to almost 90% compared to petroleum fuels. Crimson says it's excited to be a contributor to cleaner burning fuel. And coming up at 6, we'll have more on biodiesel and how it helps air quality in the Central Valley. In Bakersfield, Taylor Levesque, 23 ABC, connecting you. So you may be wondering why there's a current push for biodiesel fuel and how it benefits the environment. We took a deep dive and found some information for you tonight. Biodiesel acts as a substitute for petroleum diesel. The center says using biodiesel as a vehicle fuel improves air quality and provides safety benefits. The center says using biodiesel reduces carbon emissions because the carbon dioxide released from biodiesel is absorbed by soybeans or other feedstocks used to make the fuel. The center also says biodiesel causes far less damage than petroleum diesel if spilled or released to the environment. It's safer than petroleum diesel because it is less combustible.